Yeah, it was a memorable game for um, a lot of reasons. I think we'd gone into the game, we'd lost a few games in a row, so we're, our backs were up against the wall and um, yeah, I was obviously having a few issues with my shoulder at the time, so um, yeah, it, it went out in the game and uh, I'd said to Craigie um, before the game during the week that I said, I said to him, you know, if it happened that I would, I would be alright and I would just keep playing. So I had to back up my words and stay out there. So, But in the end it was a really good win and um, it sort of turned our season around at that time. So I think a lot of the boys have good memories of going to the SCG. So, you know, we'll be uh, confident um, and, you know, take those memories into the game this week. Needs to hit the target. And Port Police is a good target to be hitting. And he's hurt his shoulder again, but the work rate of the Adelaide Crows from their full back line right through has been extraordinary. They've taken on one of the best in the competition at that facet of the game, the Sydney Swans. And they've beat them so far. Have a look at Paul Pleasia. Very difficult when you've got a crook shoulder to get it knocked or when you come down a bit awkwardly. But obviously, fair amount of pain there. But he's just going to have to tough it out for the rest of the season. The biggest goal scorer on the ground tonight. For his fourth, never in doubt. And the Adelaide Crows can smell it from here. Times can kick another one. Oh, good thinking from Symes. Off to Port Pleasure, and he runs in. Put him down for five.